All right, guys, got a couple boxes to unbox here. And I'll give you a clue. Both of them do have to do with hair stuff or hairdresser stuff. So, heck, I might become a hairdresser here if, with the amount of stuff that I I've have. She, <laughs> well, maybe not, but yeah. I do have a lot of pro stuff um, that hairstylists would have, so and this is pretty much one more thing to add to to it. Oh yeah, and this might give it away from from this, live your extra life. So, yeah. All right. Come on, and I'm one handing it. One, so, yeah, come on. There we go. So there's a show us your look and it's at X Mondo hair and uh, X Mondo color. So that might give you even more of a clue of what it is. And then there's a big old X. And you've got some So yeah, starting off, the packing stuff is not like those disgusting um, popcorn BS. It's, it's like shredded up paper. And then the three th items are also wrapped in the shredded paper stuff. Alright, let's see what this first one is. So we've got X Mondo color, uh, super red hair. Is that heal hair healing color? And when I first got these, I was like kind of balking at the the price of it because it is twenty five dollars for for this. Um, you do get eight full ounces though, which the tubes that I get are three ounces. At the time that I got them, they were $10 a piece for th the three ounce. And I'd get three of those, so it would be about 30, around $30-ish. Um, whenever I get hair dye or s something, um, I know now I know that it takes about two tubes to do my whole hair and my current hair that I did yellow I did um, one one whole tube and that was just my roots that I did but uh, yeah let me I'll open this up and I do believe this this will do a, a whole head of hair um, of course it depends on if it's really long or if it's short my hair is short so it would probably do the whole hair if I were to do my whole hair here and it comes with a little I don't know a um, little thing here yeah come on ah, there we go and I gave it the sniff test and yeah, it, it smells similar to the Pravana. Oh no, I, I said another cult, hair dye, hair dye brand. But yeah, I am actually really excited to test this out because what I'm thinking of doing is doing a 
split kind of hair dye video, uh, which I'm going to do like Ex Mondo red color against the Pravana red because I do have, I got the colors that I have in Pravana and I really want to do a comparison. Um, but yeah, the, the red looks really nice so far. Uh, so yeah. And it does smell good. Uh, the Pravana actually, like I said, it does smell somewhat similar to this X Mondo color. So, so it's not going to be like you're going to die from putting it on your hair. Uh, the bleach, on the other hand, uh, that I use is, is, oof, yeah, <laughs> yeah, the, but, uh, yeah. Anyways, let's get to the next one, which you'll probably guess what the rest of these are, but. But, uh, yeah, I got kind of. pretty much only knew about the Mondo line because my, my hairstylist mentioned that I looked looked like uh, Brad Mondo, so I don't know. I'll do the outro and show my face and see, see if you agree or disagree, but so yeah. And ah, here's the green. I also have green Bravana, uh, and that's why I got this as well. Um, I'll, I'm going to try all these, of course, against uh, the uh, Bravana. Uh, see which one I like, or from the looks of it, it's looking like it might be a tie, in my opinion, because both smell good and the the just the sheer look of of the dye on both of them look good okay well this is green but it looks like it's blue on the video but it it is green <laughs> super green so yeah but for some reason it's more of a blue green in the video but it is a deeper green uh, in person so and again the it does smell like the red and this last one which I didn't really I it's my favorite color and I as you can see I I opened this and I had no clue which dye was which but this is actually really cool that I'm ending on this dye because it is my favorite even the last last dye for my favorite la dye for last. That's that was unplanned, but I don't mind it. All right, my favorite color. It's uh, super purple. I'm I think I might start with this because of course it's my favorite color and it's really going to have to do a lot for because I love the Pravana purple uh, it's very rich and dark and shiny so as my email notification let you know that I'm getting an email but uh, yeah so 
looking at it, it does look really nice. And I do appreciate that they have a little tab here because if it was just flush, yeah, he would, I would, you know, like you can get it from the side, I guess. So, but yeah, they have a, do have a nice tab. But ooh, yeah, that is looking really nice. Uh, again, it smells like the other two dyes, uh, so it's not going to murder you, <laughs> or hopefully it doesn't. Uh, so um, yeah, so yeah, I think that's pretty much it. And yeah, I'll probably start with the purple first. And do the dual color. I am thinking I'm going to start with one side, wash it out, and then do the other side. And so, yeah. Ooh, I've already got some hair dye on. Oh no. I should have worn gloves, but oh, I'm going to have purple fingers now for the rest of my life. Oh, that's such a tragedy. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to doing the hair dye comparisons. It, it's probably going to be difficult to do since it's going to be the same color, just a different brand. And I hope that Brad Mondo does see the video and does a review of it and doesn't mind me doing comparison of uh, two different hair dyes so but uh, seeing videos of his product being used um, I think I will be um, happy with with the colors it's just oh, it's gonna be hard to uh, declare a winner I guess it, if I do it do this so <laughs> but anyways on to the uh, outro now all right guys so I hope you enjoyed that video I know I enjoy um, making these uh, unboxings and especially with like hair hair stuff like hair dyes and um, and uh, like hairstylist stuff because and I will say that I'm not a professional hair hair stylist or anything or I just one day I was like uh, I don't want I, I want to hide the the gray hairs that are just keep coming uh, so in, instead of doing like a natural hair hair color like my natural hair is a blonde so instead of doing like my natural blonde color um, I I was like well let's do uh, let's do some some purple I started off with purple because of course that's my favorite and I actually did the whole my whole hair is purple and then I got I was like hmm why don't I just do the roots when they start coming out just do the roots and then do a different color and so as you can see that I haven't had the yellow in for very long and it's with the Bravana uh, I, I really love the Bravana line and my hairstylist is really impressed with um, how they look the, they've always complimented and liked how well the pigment is on it and stuff um, and of course I do have to give a shout out to my hairdresser I'm not gonna really like say their name because I of course I don't have permission I always like to ask permission before I just drop a name but they did give a crash course and I that was surprising when I was like oh I it because I my bleach my bleached hair was not quite there and the and so and tell me about oh if you get it like 
as wide as you can, then the color is going to stay longer and it's going to just pop better. So, yeah. So, got a crash course in bo both the bleach and the color. And so, yeah. And that's where it is now. It's like very, it's like I went to a professional hairstylist, but haven't. Uh, she she really did do this because it would have been very expensive to do this for her to do it. I mean, she she did do a bleaching and a color um, to just to teach us kind of thing, and so I thought that was really cool. Um, but it, uh, yeah, I did pay pay for the bleach in the in the uh, coloring. But I think it was uh, a money well spent <laughs> for those lessons uh, that I was not really, I was like shocked that, that she'd be willing to uh, do that for me. Well, for my mom, because my mom does do my hair because I, I, pro I could do the like the front probably myself but the back not so much so so yeah anyways this is going on for a, a long outro probably my longest outro <laughs> out of all my videos but I am very excited to try try a new hair dye product because uh, I've always done Pravana and I've never I've always been happy with all the Pravana hair uh, dyes that I've gotten uh, alright guys so I've got got uh, this last thing to unbox here And this thing. <laughs> Two things. Uh, mm, okay, and things keep falling all over the place. And I'm throwing shit around all over the place. Holes. And lastly, I think so we have this 
tray here. And yeah. So if you haven't guessed, this is for like putting stuff uh, hair hair stuff on like scissors and and bleach and dye and stuff like that. So I'll get into the instructions here and see what I need to do to assemble this thing. some do's and don'ts. Oh man, they say not to throw away the, the instructions. What? <laughs> thought that's what everybody did was throw the instructions away. So I need to look for some bolts because it looks like I didn't unpack everything. bucks for this thing I think that's what it what it paid I'll uh, have the affiliate link I'll get a little bit of money if you do order this or anything else from the link so all right I think this goes on after I over I'm saying to put the this round disc on in the center here as well that it had is uh, like stoppers so that you can stop the wheels from going so that the tray doesn't like go get away from you but yeah it's a small gripe I guess uh, I have noticed that these are going in fairly easily so Done. 
All right, looks like next is to uh, take the bolt out of the end of the pole. guessing it's going to be stuck. I have to move the thing. Yeah, and then I put the wheel thing, flip it over and put the bolt in. So, yeah, if I was correct though. I kind of wanted to get something that had like um, drawers and stuff, but I didn't want to pay like 300 you know, for it, so this is the cheaper alternative. Hopefully it's going to last. <laughs> One thing I noticed is I don't think it comes with any tools, so you will need some tools it looks like. So let me see if I can, I do have, I do have lots of tools because I do pinball repair, so I'm going to have, have this, alright, so let me go look for the tool to tighten that down. All right, so I'm going to use this tool, which I'm too lazy to look for the ratchet thing, so it's just going to basically be hand tight. But I think this will be fine. Alright, got that tightened down. And then the next next thing is to untighten this little hand tightener thingy. So that's that. And now it's to unscrew the top part there and put on the tray. one I will tighten down all the way because it's pretty much there. All right. So that's that step. And Alright, and then next is to put the stuff to hold, like the blow dryer and, the, and my curling iron and stuff uh, in, and then screw it in, which I do have that stuff. I'm 
I'm going to go out a little bit on this. All right, and then I'm going to get the tool to get tighten that down, and then we'll basically be done. All right, flip this around and tighten these puppies up. In. And that's basically it. I'll uh, move, move it to the kitchen where I do the bleaching and hair dye and adjust it to hopefully it'll be high enough. So, but uh, let's do this. All right, guys, so this is. With the, it not extended, it's all the way down, but uh, I will uh, extend it. <sighs> all right, so that's all the way extended. So let me adjust the camera now. So this is actually, I think, too high. Um, so I am going to adjust it down a bit. And probably should adjust it. Have my mom adjust it too, because of course she is a bit shorter than I am, but I think this will give a good, good, good uh, deal, so. Alright, don't know if this is going to be good, but I guess we'll see. Alright guys, so. nicely um, it is I think I believe it's 50 bucks um, I'll put on the screen how much I put or, or how much I bought it for um, and uh, of course the link to this um, and it has the tray does have slight dent some slight dents on it but it's not mm, it's nothing like I'm gonna be all mad about because it's it is a cheap, like 50 bucks so it's cheap and it, it's gonna get beaten up because we're gonna be doing hair hair stuff with it and, uh, and yeah the Brad Mondo brand hair dye fits nicely on it but of course, it doesn't have nearly the stuff that we uh, use, but, and uh, so yeah. And not sponsored. Uh, I forgot to say that in the other unboxing, but I 
did buy these with my own money. I did get like a 10% discount on it because these are usually about 25 bucks a piece, but I think I paid like $68 or something and some change. So it wasn't completely like 75 bucks for these, but uh, yeah. But uh, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video um, of uh, even more hair, hair stuff, or stuff to uh, do with hair. Uh, I'm really, my, I told my mom that I got something that she would appreciate because she's on her feet for hours doing my bleaching and hair color so this because uh, said to go back and forth to the uh, dye because it le leaves it on the counter there so this will make it so that she can now uh, wheel this around and it can be out here instead of over there and uh, so yeah hoping that this will make it easier on her um, and yeah, I basically got got a whole studio here now, a uh, hair, hair studio. Because, um, yeah, I started off with like basically literally putting plastic bags over, over me with the head cut out. And uh, from getting an actual tape and an apron for the person that's doing the bleaching and the dyeing. So yeah, and now a tray. Uh, so yeah, well, and I I did get like the the little cont uh, brush and the thing to mix the bleach and stuff. I got two separate things. I got a blue blue brush and the little mixing thing to uh, mix the bleach in and then I got purple for the color because of course purple is my favorite color so I had to do purple for the cup the uh, dye uh, even if it isn't purple f per se uh, so so yeah uh, I can't wait to uh, use the tray and the, and the new hair color. Uh, unfortunately, I did just do the yellow recently, so it's gonna be probably another two months or so before I go and do the, uh, the uh, kind of uh, review of Pravana and the, uh, now the new X Mondo. Uh, and uh, yeah, I do enjoy Brad, Brad's um, videos, and uh, so yeah, I'm looking forward. I'm, I like I said in the other video, I'm really going to be. It's going to be hard to pick a winner kind of thing with all, each of these colors because I do like. The Bravana line, and I think I am gonna like Brad's uh, cover line though too. So it is gonna be difficult to choose, I think, because they both are really nice. Uh, so, <laughs> so yeah. If you like this this video, I hope you give it a thumbs up or not, and uh, also hit the subscribe that now it, the bell is integrated in now so and uh, also I'll see you in the next video bye everyone bye bye